Okay, we're going to look into the last section of this particular area, which is logical model versus physical model. Now, the idea about physical model is the actual product in the actual environment. That is what we consider as the physical model, all right? The one that you can implement. But at this current moment, we are not going to move into physical model yet. We are just going to work with the logical model because physical model will come much later. So what logical model do we usually use? Well, one of it is actually the sequence of model. Right? So that basically means first we study the physical operation okay, of whatever the system is right now. And we just want to know how things are done. All right. Then we create a logical model of the current system so that we can build the new system, but still in the logical model. Or right? still in the logical model. Uh, of course, there can be uh, iteration to clarify the system analyst uh, assumption. All right. But only after the new logical model is built, then you we'll think about how to deploy it in the new physical model. All right. So the new physical model is actually at the end. Okay. So current physical, current logical, then you change it to a new logical system. Right. Then you move to the last one, which is the new physical model. So we are actually using four different model at one sequence. That is why it is known as the four model approach.